Hi friends, CA here. And I'm TK. And RB. And if you remember, we've started the Wizarding Correspondent School. Tacos Correspondent School. Previously, those both happened. Completed lesson one, which is the Orn Feather. Lesson two, which is the Green Maze. And, and today's lesson is lesson Blue three, fairy. Blue Fish. Blue Fish? <laughs> Last part, Tacos and his friends were dragged under the water by something that lives in the water. Yes, where we left off after lesson two is we helped them follow a maze and the room they ended up in started to fill up with water. Yeah. Uh, the team there indicated that there was something swimming in the water brushed by his leg. And that's where we've left them. So the hope is with lesson three, we'll be able to help them get out of that giant fishbowl. That's what it sounds like. Yeah. Our lesson plan. Do we have another maze? Research for wizards. Every great adventure comes with sudden surprises that will test your ability to quickly recover lost items, artifacts, and party members. Find the seven prized artifacts listed in the photo diagram. Use the grid to identify the location of each artifact. The locations of the artifacts will also reveal the name of the creature that lurks in the water. Send the locations to Taco on the Stone of Far Speech. Now that doesn't really look like a manta ray, yet it does. <sighs> Let's mark that one. Let's see. What number is that? Two, no, six, five. five. We have all of them except for one. Seeing all the hints wouldn't be a big deal for this scenario. Mm -hmm. The loafers of striding and sprinting are near a leaning cane. Okay, let's see if that helps us any. No, because the leaning cane's probably as hard to find as the loafers. <laughs> Look, I found loafers. Wait, where's the leaning cane? Where's the, if you're trying to look for the leaning cane, maybe then you'll find the loafers. See, see how that works? It's sort of backwards. Those are them. Yep, that's them. Hard to see the. You can partially see the wings <laughs> going behind the post. All right, so let's. This is two. Okay, what are two's coordinates? No. Yes. Okay. Yes. So we entered everything, right? Fingers crossed. Let's check. Ah. Was wrong. It was wrong. <laughs> That's to figure. Okay, let's just enter it again to make sure we didn't put in the wrong character. Oh wait. That's what you have to do the. This one first, besides instead of that one, right? <laughs> that one, how feckin' dare you? All right, let's try that again. Sorry, because it is the top and then the side. Let's make sure, because maybe this doesn't line up properly. So try this, because the line's right here. <laughs> Yay! Yes, that was <laughs> that was oh that was so close. It was right on the line. Nice. So we've done lesson three, blue fish, and we're ready to move on. Ready to move on to lesson four. The purple, purple wrench. wrench. And you know what, this one, 
of all the lessons is the heaviest. It contains a wrench. It That's contains why it's a labeled wrench. That. If you like this video, don't forget to like it. Like it. Subscribe and press the bell icon so you get notification so you get notified when the other parts of this video and our other out. videos are uploaded. Yeah, our other videos are pretty great too. We'll include links to the previous part two lessons so that in case you're just coming in now and you can follow up with those. And as always, three, three to be mouth.